Hello everyone. Now let's continue with the anatomy of the eye in this lecture. So you can see cornea. Then behind that there is anterior chamber filled with aqueous humor. Then there is iris containing pupil in between. Behind that there is posterior chamber. Behind that there is ciliary body containing lens. Then there is vitreous body filled with vitreous humor. Now you can see there is sclera, the whiter outcoat of the eye surrounding the iris. Then there is choroid and what is that? It is layer containing blood vessels that lines the back of the eye and is located between the retina and the sclera. Then there is fovea. The center of the macula which provides the sharp vision. This is all about the anatomy of the eye. Now let's understand how the eye works. The five senses include sight, sound, taste, hearing and touch. Sight like other senses is closely related to other parts of our anatomy. The eye is connected to the brain and dependent upon the brain to interpret what we see. How we see depends upon the transfer of the light. Light passes through front of the eye that is cornea to the lens. The cornea and the lens help to focus the light rays onto the back of the eye that is retina. The cells in the retina absorb and convert the light to electrochemical impulses which are transferred along the optic nerve and then to the brain. The eye works much the same as a camera. The shutter of a camera can close or open depending upon the amount of light needed to expose the film in the back of the camera. The eye, like the camera shutter, operates in the same way. The iris and the pupil control how much light to let into the back of the eye. When it is very dark, our pupils are very large, letting in more light. The lens of a camera is able to focus on objects far away and up close with the help of mirrors and other mechanical devices. The lens of the eye help us to focus but sometimes need some additional help in order to focus clearly. Glasses, contact lenses and artificial lenses all help us to see more clearly. That's all for this lecture. Hope you understand well about it. Bye-bye.